guys, welcome to another video. Today is going to be another vlog. Uh, it's an... Uh, yo, quit it. That was my dog. Uh, today is going to be, uh, I don't know, part two of the current vlog or the last vlog. They're going, they're going. Uh, we are at a completely different stage now. Um, there are more lockdowns, there are more curfews. Uh, people are uh, starting to loosen a little bit more. Uh, you get, you have like lesser fines every night, uh, lesser arrests because they're actually arresting people at night. You know that are breaking the curfew, and these people are getting exposed on on media's. You know everything. So it's like Facebook pages, news pages, and everything. And you just, you know, they just go live with Facebook and they they show everything. It's kind of fucked up, but you know. I guess every every little bit helps. It's you know people. I think people are understanding it a little bit more now, and people are more calm uh, as as they were before. Before people were just you know going to the groceries and buying all kinds of stuff, you know, because they don't know what's gonna happen. But now people are more like calm down, and uh, a lot of people did lose their jobs. A lot of people um, are having a very difficult time now, which is understandable because, like I mentioned before, our whole economy is based on tourism. So if there's no tourism, there's nobody coming in, there's nobody to sell anything, there's no, no service to be given, hence there's no money. Uh, right now, I believe we're gonna get a little bit of money um, from from the Netherlands, way, way back, or who was like colonized by the Dutch and you know, they were part of you know their kingdom, you know, and then in 1986, uh, we got our status aparte, or, you know, whatever it's called, whatever it's called, but I think it's called something like that, you know, um, in public man, it's like status aparte, but, you know, I, you know, I think there's a word for it, like I just mentioned before as well. Anyways, I'm rambling on about something, but from, since I, 1986, Aruba's got their own government, and they've been trying to govern, uh, the island all these years. They're doing a good job, you know, but things happen, times change, um, you, you, you have more projects and all this stuff and you know you get a lot of debt blah 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 just like any other country in the world uh but right now i think we are in a major major debt we were already in major debt we did get like a little bit of uh um of help from from the netherlands a little bit of money i believe it's like 40 something million euros which is nothing actually because we need like 1.3 or 1.6 billion um you know for the next coming months to help all the people that are without jobs, help the businesses, and you know, just maintain the economy above water, above float. Uh, but other than that, people are really um, staying calm, people staying inside, uh, they're cooking, they're doing what they have to do. Yo, quit it, bro. But I guess there's a there's a positive side, you know, to get out of everything else. Because like the positive side now is like people that, you know, were selling food and never delivered. Are actually having to deliver now food you know which is like a new service that they can you know offer or people with businesses actually you know instead of closing down they opened up a website and uh they have like this virtual shop now you can just go online kind of like amazon basically and you can order your things and they'll bring it for you you, you, you know you have like a like a pos machine wireless portable so you can just you know swipe your card and pay right there and then a lot of people are on tiktok now TikTok. TikTok. Myself included. I was already on TikTok for, for a while. I had videos like last year and then I took it, took them down and I closed TikTok and then I opened it again or reactivated it and put some videos again. And then I, you know, stopped logging in and it wasn't up, uh, up till I think about three weeks ago when I was just bored and I was like, well, let me create some stuff and I actually win on TikTok again and uh but a lot of people on the island are on TikTok, you know, term it's funny though because I you know people are just you know try to stay busy, which is understandable because that's what you have to do because if you're not busy you're just gonna you know consume yourself with all these crazy conspiracy theories and, and, and you know all this stuff which, which it's already a lot of whoa bro you know 5G and the, the coronavirus and this and that and you know it's conspiracy, new world order, oh my god. So yeah, you know, you gotta, you gotta stay sane, you gotta stay busy. Yo? Yeah? As my daughter, 
I'm making a video. I'm gonna have to go and cut it now, guys, because uh, I gotta go play with her. So I'm gonna cut this video short. Um, wait, wait, wait. This is Ninja, by the way, because he's like he looks like a ninja. He's like a ninja. He, he eats everything in the house. Like he eats everything in the house. And I have another dog, a big pit bull. I look at him. He like bit his head, so he has like this ball spot on his head right here. Poor guy. But I think it's I think it's getting better. But he's a he's a Dutch Shepherd. Now he's he's a handful, man. He's annoying. He's so annoying. He breaks everything in the house, breaks everything, and eats everything. Eats all my shoes, all my clothes. I'm gonna go, guys. Take care. I'll see you in another vlog. And um, be safe. Peace out.